senior from Arlington, Texas, is set to hit it. And we are off and running with college football on BTN. This one soaring over the head of Sexton out of the end zone. It's a tough 15. Plenty of time. Rifles this one right on the button there for Arthur Jackson. Jim of the Boilermakers in black. Uyghurs to throw. Puts it out there for Blake Bannum. Bannum is stacked up by Antonio Blackman. Week after Sindelar opened up with three first half interceptions against Northwestern. Knox trying to power his way, keeping those legs moving as he's tracked down shy of first down yardage. Sure. Third and short. Van crunched, wrapped up quickly. Cornell Jones was there. Eastern Michigan, outstanding defensive ends as Blau will throw this one. Connecting for a first down yardage. This will tell you that Sparks is the most competitive of the wideouts for Purdue. Jones breaking tackles into Eastern Michigan territory, and he runs right on through. A huge gain. In relief last week in that loss to Northwestern. Hands it off for Knox. Knox gets out of the gate and dives down to the Eastern Michigan 16 deep. Blau on the quarterback keep. Slips past one tackle. The ball came out. That ball is loose. Eastern Michigan thinking they forced a turnover. The umpire, though, Britt Danker, says this ball is going to stay with Purdue. 40 in his career. As he remains perfect in that regard. His mate's in trouble. Eastern Michigan in the white jerseys. Uyghurs looking for a deep ball down the sideline. Got it! It'll go to Matthew Sexton. And they won't catch him. Touchdown, Eastern Michigan, 75 yards. Campaign. Rondell Moore in motion. He'll take the jet sweep. Moore reversing his field, and he's got room. Rondell Moore across midfield. Moore cuts it back, runs into a teammate. He's brought down. Rondale Moore. Attention, including Chris Creighton, of course, the Eastern Michigan head coach. Fuller lowering his shoulders. Tario Fuller bouncing off of tackles. He's always rushing three and dropping eight. You have to be careful throwing the ball here. Blau will dump it off. Connecting to Tario Fuller. And Fuller is uh, tracked down and smothered there by Jeremiah Harris. Kick on the way. And true. Evan. Glass. Had that one deflected. Quick hands from Kai Higgins. They can build on that moving forward. That was a critical personal foul late in the game on Lorenzo Neal. The Boilermakers are operating. Eastern Michigan, that's where we were after the first quarter. Blau turns a corner. Blau angled and finished off there by the diving Vince Calhoun. On the one today, giving them the 7-6 lead. Blau from the pocket on a crossing route. Makes a connection there. The ball bounces loose. And it's covered up for Eastern Michigan. The ball bouncing free out of the hands of Rondale Moore in its situations. Follow the bouncing ball off of Rondale Moore. Second and 10. Uyghurs looking over the middle. Lobs this one, and Oates comes down with it. First down, Eagles. Purdue will rush four. Eastern Michigan keeps it on the ground. Snaking his way along there is Shaq Van. Now a fastball in baseball. It showed him the other day in practice. He has a live arm. Mid-90s in high school there. He'll throw and complete to Cole Herdman, who makes his third catch of the day. Put in crossing routes. Less than three to go in the opening half. Sindelar tips this one down the middle. Complete. Sindelar finds Terry Wright for the Eagles. First and ten, Purdue. Play action. Sindelar to the tight end, Hopkins. Bryson Hopkins is wrestled down. Again, it was Phelps there. To Sindelar, ninth play of this drive. He'll roll inside on the pitch there. Markel Jones. Touchdown, Boilermakers. Little passing yardage. <laughs> Spencer Evans. Uh-oh. That one is missed. Evans pushed it to the opening half. 
Uyghurs leaves it for Shaq Van. And Van, with those long strides, now gets out across the 40. Now you Uyghurs getting it quickly, keeping the offense humming. That pass nearly picked, but it's caught by Bryce Kemp. And Kemp will rumble into Purdue territory. Second and short. Quick fling out there to Bannum as Bannum slices through, gets a great block. Blake Bannum deep into the Boilermaker territory, knocked away by Jacob Thieneman. 27 yarder on the way. And good. Side of the field. Three for seven on third down conversion. Sindelar throws this one incomplete. It's behind Rondale Moore. And a third and seven. Uyghurs launching again. And he has his man. It's Bannum who got... Uyghurs will throw. Avoiding the blitz pressure. And then taking down the ball's loose. Marcus Bailey able to put himself into the picture. Kid, good call by Nick Holt. Defensive coordinator. Elijah Singler hands this one off, and it's Markel Jones straight ahead. And Jones powers his way to the 33-yard line. Sindelar, who did not start today. Sindelar wrapped up and sacked by Crosby. And a penalty. Last to throw. Good protection. Put that one right on the money for Banamu. Blast with plenty of time. He'll sprint to the sideline and be tackled. Been the start by Jeff Brom. Purdue stays on the ground with Knox, and he has some room there as he's just tripped up on the outside by Ike Calderon, who's blitz off the edge. Knox takes it the other way, and he'll break free. Sindelar under center. Knox is stacked up, and he's not going to get it. Eastern Michigan. The defense stiffens. Max Crosby's jumping for joy with his mates. They're going. Whoops. Uyghurs picks the ball up. Trying to make something out of nothing. It's incomplete. Sindelar from the pistol. There's a flag down. As uh, Jones gallops ahead. He lost the football, but there is a flag down. Jones lost the football. Eastern Michigan's Ike Calderon is coming away from the pack with it. The ruling on the field is a fumble recovered by Eastern Michigan. The flag is for the illegal formation offense. That penalty is declined. First down. And Purdue make him uncomfortable in the pocket. Rushing four. He has all sorts of time. Zips this one on a comeback route for Jackson. Jackson breaking loose, and he'll stroll out of bounds in 10. Uyghurs going through the progression. Zips it outside. It's juggled, then caught. As the Boilermakers keep tabs on Janoon in a tight-knit game. Sindelar forced out of the pocket. Sindelar throws, and that one is out of bounds as he hooked. Lined up against Kaysen then. Uyghurs over the middle to Benham. Complete. And that was a bullet by the quarterback run game. Glass pulls it down, then throws over the middle, and that low catch is on target, and it's into the fourth. Uyghurs sticks that one in the belly, and this is a walk-in. A touchdown for Breck Turner, and the Eagles have the lead. They got to the fourth quarter and had, had a chance, and now they're in the lead. Jackson Anthrop from the nine. Anthrop across the 35, an impressive return there. Four with 6.50 left, and Purdue in come from behind mode. It's Knox breaking loose. DJ's on his way, sprinting to the house. Touchdown. DJ Knox covers in 10. Uyghurs had that one deflected and picked. An incredible effort there. Sindelar takes the snap. Pressure off the edge. Floats it out there. Diving effort. Incredible grab, but they're going to say no. It's where that foot comes down. That doesn't look like he's inbounds. Here it is right here. Reaches the left hand up. Looks like that right heel is out of bounds. Snap and Mulder 
are good. Kick is on the way, and this one's drifting. No good. Purdue down. Uyghurs into the flat to Oaks. Oaks undercut there. Buckeyes, this is fourth and long now. Fourth and 15 for Uyghurs. Steps up in the pocket. Beautiful route on target. He's got Arthur Jackson. First down, Eagles inside the Purdue 30. Bert Purdue's chance to go for two. They had to go for one. The handoff to Erickson. He powers his way. Still pushing the pile are the Eagles. Uyghurs will spike. Ryland, the freshman, snaps down. Kicks on the way, and it is good. A 24-yard field goal at the buzzer for Chad Ryland, and Eastern Michigan takes down Purdue. They did a great job of throwing and catching the ball today in inclement weather. Impressed with Tyler Wiegers, the quarterback, grad transfer from Iowa.